20 latest web design trends and forecasts for 2022-2023 you should know. What are the current trends in web design? The entry of 2021 comes with renewed optimism and a haul of exciting developments. Web design is headed to a change in both strategy and form. Upon navigating the events that transpired in 2020, which include COVID-19 and an ongoing community quarantine period, nascent ways to search will come to the fore. Web design trends that have been gestating since the mid-2010s will become the norm. Advancements, as indicated in these machine learning statistics, will tailor each website to the individual user. During these heady times, it's easy to overlook why a website looks and feels the way it does. Major design philosophies and principles are in play for every change, whether it's to make it easier for users to find what they're looking for or to convert leads into sales. This is why this video exists so you can understand the mechanics of what's trending in web design and leverage them to make your website more fluid, appealing, and functional. While you can hire a web designer for cutting-edge web design, you can certainly do it yourself with little to no coding or design experience. Our picks of best website builder software will make it easy for you to lay the foundation for your website or even make a fully featured e-commerce platform. Web Design Trends 2023 Table of Contents 20. Privacy and Data Collection 19. Full Screen Forms 18. Split Screen Layout 17. Hamburger Menus Revisited 16. Pseudo 3D 15. Data Visualization 14. Original Illustrations 13. Dark Mode 12. Evolution of SEO 11. Dynamic Scrolling 10. Interactivity 09. Chatbits 08. Accessibility 067. Responsive and Adaptive Design 06. Asymmetric Layouts 05. Color Theory Redux 04. Smart Video 03. Web Design in Motion 02. Premium White Space 01. Flat is in 20. Privacy and Data Collection It's no secret that websites and companies collect data. This is for the purpose of business intelligence, which is used to gain insight into business operations for better performance. However, most consumers have become concerned that companies are using big data to push unwanted products or services, even compromise their personal information. The introduction of the General Data Protection Regulation, GDPR, data collection, and how they pertain to privacy has come to the forefront of the discussion. This limits and describes how websites collect and use data. 2021 will force websites to be more transparent on the data they're gathering, and for what purpose. While this is not exactly a trend, as it's a regulation, this means that people will become warier of sites that do not have their best interest in mind. Communicating with your visitors and letting them know how you're using their data to improve their experience can go a long way toward building customer goodwill. Privacy and Data Collection Highlights Data collection is part of business intelligence and, thus, a required part of business operations. The introduction of the General Data Protection Regulation limits and describes how companies collect and use personal data online, Urelex, 2016. It will make businesses more transparent with the data they collect from visitors expect more disclaimers for consensual data collection. It can also make your website look more trustworthy. 19. Full Screen Forms – Privacy and Data Collection Minimalism is in fashion again in 2021 and beyond. 
and this carries over to the user experience, especially in how they interact with your website. A form is one such way to improve interactivity, but you can combine a minimalist approach with it by using either a single field form or a full screen form. Or both, for that matter. A full screen form may have a single field or multiple fields, but whichever the case, it will take up a huge amount of space on your screen, even taking the whole screen. The beauty of a full screen form is that you can focus the visitor's attention and get the additional information you need without unnecessarily cluttering the page. Expect full screen forms to be the norm in 2021, moving forward. Gone are the days when you need to input your answers in a questionnaire containing multiple items. Now, you will interact with the brand in a focused step-by-step -step full screen form, whose content changes dynamically as you answer. Full screen forms highlights. Full screen forms combine minimalism with interactivity. It allows you to focus the visitor's attention on the information you need. You can use multi-step full screen forms, single field forms, or multiple field forms. Some forms even dynamically change as the guest interacts with its content. 18. Split Screen Layout Using a split screen layout can also be counted as part of the broken grid movement, but this is an oversimplification. Split screens mean that two usually equal halves of a page can display different things, but normally related to or caused by each other. A classic case of split screen layout means the menus are on one side and the information on the left. These are exactly why e-commerce web design trends are using split screen layouts increasingly. 2021 will also see an evolution of the classic split screen design. Unlike the old split screen, where two content types are split in the middle symmetrically, more asymmetric designs will happen. The dividing line itself will fade and will instead be replaced by interactive objects, even the menu itself, or light and dark mode switches. Split screens are also inherently usable with the responsive format. For example, on desktops, they may look split, but on mobiles, they would look stacked, even layered on top of each other for a 3D effect. In any case, in 2020, where personalization of web content is the norm, allowing the visitor to pick a content type or path that suits them is exactly what a split-screen layout provides. Split-screen layout highlights. Split-screen layouts are akin to broken grid layouts. This is great for personalizing content or letting visitors pick a content type or path. Classic split screen is by far the most common, but interactive and asymmetric split screen layouts will become more common in 2021. Split screen layouts are also inherently usable in responsive formats. 17. Hamburger Menus Revisited Its name is funny, but hamburger menus have taken over in website navigation design because they can save a lot of real estate space on any page. They, however, also come with challenges, chief of which is that navigation elements in a hamburger menu tend to be hidden. In 2021, redesigning the hamburger menu to be more visible will take place. This means making the menu itself look like a button using soft shadows and layers, see preceding section. Removing call-to-action links in the hamburger menu and putting them out in the open and avoiding hiding the main navigation link in it will also make it more useful and veer from the usual pitfalls of using hamburger menus. Hamburger menus aren't right for everyone, however. If you're unsure whether they add value to your site or not, stick with floating menus, the regular grid, or the next one on our list. Hamburger menus highlights. Hamburger menus are controversial because they introduce as many problems as they solve. Redesigning hamburger menus for 2021 will address these issues. Removing call-to-action sections in hamburger menus can fix this. It's also a good idea to make the hamburger menu icon more prominent, visible, or button-like. 16. Pseudo 3D Google used to slay it with material design, which is still serviceable, but people are now slowly transitioning to web design that uses soft shadows and floating navigation. In 2021, web design shouldn't just be restricted to graphical elements. Applying this design to text as well can unify the design and make it rise from the flat background, creating depth and a pseudo-3D effect. Floating menus are also useful here, where elements of navigation stay on top as you move through the site. Apart from practical reasons so the visitor won't get lost and they have a lifeline anywhere they are on your website, it can also be tool to provide a unique appealing experience. You don't have to limit yourself to top menus. 
However, as you can place them anywhere you can make a statement. Pseudo 3D Highlights Material design by itself will no longer carry web design in 2021. Soft shadows, floating design elements, and layers will become more commonplace. Taken together, it creates the illusion of a 3D effect. Floating menus will also be useful to emphasize this. 15. Data Visualization What's better than data? Data that can be imagined and understood, of course. Data is useless if it's not interpreted correctly. Some data visualization tools, a subset of business intelligence software, already exist to automatically make sense of data. However, this is usually only available to businesses, and for your readers, they're rather esoteric and inaccessible. In 2021, web design will also incorporate some form of presenting data so they can be easier to understand for regular people. While you can be simply content to take a screenshot of a chart or graph that your data visualization software has done for you and embed it on a page, some sites take it a bit further. Sites like Codex Atlanticus use interactivity to its fullest with their utilization of various visualization modes, Codex Atlanticus 2021. 2021 will see more of these become part of comprehensive websites as actual service platforms, not just repositories of information. Data visualization highlights. Data is only as good as how it's interpreted. New websites will now use data visualization for visitors to make sense of certain trends or statistics. Sites like Codex Atlanticus have proven that interactive data visualization can be highly useful to chart consumption. It will also mean that more brands will use interactive data visualization to make such platforms closer to a SaaS model. 14 Original Illustrations In B2B web design, the easiest way to make eye candy is simply to add stock photos on your website, and you're done. In 2021, you will risk making your site look generic and bland. To inject your place on the internet with your characteristic flavor, you have to use unique illustrations that not only portray what you do and what you're about but talk to the heart of the matter. These can come at a higher cost than simply looking for appropriate stock images, but they can do so much more. You can customize the illustrations to tell a story, for example, which is where narrative illustration shines. You can use illustrated figures of people, animals, objects, and even abstract things to make them more relatable and personal. For example, Trustly, a popular online mortgage broker, features a homepage embellished with original illustrations. People in illustrations now also tend to be colored purple. After all, it is a hue commonly associated with inclusivity and acceptance, Michael Page, 2020. Using purple would likely solve diversity problems or people of color portrayals. Expect this trend to become even more commonplace in 2021 with a broader array of illustrated types. Original illustrations highlights. Using stock photos is so last decade, original illustrations are in. Narrative illustrations can be used for a more visual representation that can range from a how-to to brand display. Illustrations give your site, and your brand, by extension, more personality. Human figures in these illustrations tend to be colored purple since it represents inclusivity, diversity, and acceptance. 13. Dark Mode Dark Mode has been here for a few years, but it's become the rage these days since it makes for easier reading and improves nighttime visibility, Techlians, 2020. Besides its prominence in mobile operating systems, it has also become a go-to UI structure. Delving further, Dark Mode makes use of negative space above to create a stylish aesthetic and highlight important elements in a web page. Beyond style points, however, using dark mode has plenty of practical applications. For example, YouTuber PhoneBuff has tested that dark mode in iPhones can save up to 30% of your battery life, Business Insider, 2021. Note, however, that for phones with LCD screens, dark mode has negligible benefits, only OLED screen phones seem to save energy using dark mode. In web design, 
expect dark mode to make a bigger mark in 2021 and beyond. With the rising prevalence of bold colors and white space, dark mode allows certain elements to pop out. This is useful if you want to highlight a call to action, for example, or to emphasize your branding. Dark Mode Highlights The launch of iOS 13 in September 2019 heralded a more mainstream and OS-native support of Dark Mode. Dark Mode will become more prevalent in 2021 to match the use of bold colors and minimalism. It can be used to highlight certain elements on a web page, such as a call to action. Dark mode can save around 30% of your battery if your phone has an OLED screen, Business Insider, 2021. 12 Evolution of SEO With the turbulent changes in store for search, in general, and web design, SEO itself will likely need to adapt to the changes in its ecosystem. Chief of these is the increased importance of snippets, knowledge cards, and graphs, and POS, people also ask, in Google. Search engines, primarily Google, are also looking toward more non-keyword-based search, like voice. Long-tail keywords and natural language will, thus, be more prioritized over artificially sounding traditional keywords most people voice search by how they speak. After all, local content will also become more important in the coming years. 46% of Google searches, HubSpot, 2020, already look for local information, which will be even more critical later on. Searches with the near me or close by modifiers have increased ninefold in the last two years. SEO software can help your website utilize SEO best practices moving forward. Alternatively, and especially for e-commerce websites, a website building software like BigCommerce has SEO integration to ensure you're taking advantage of the most effective techniques in SEO. Evolution of SEO Highlights SEO will need to adapt from traditional keyword-based optimization to a search ecosystem that uses voice, VR, and AR. Snippets will become more important including knowledge cards and people also ask sections. Google will also be competing with verticals and publishers in 2021 and beyond. 46% of Google searches already look for local information, which is expected to grow in the coming years. 11. Dynamic scrolling Scrolling is not dead. And it's back with a vengeance. 2020 has seen the rise of websites with a single page that you can scroll to the bottom as well as parallax websites, Impact Plus, 2021, and so the trend will continue in 2021. The use of single page scrolling, or dynamic scrolling, means it's perfect for websites with a story to tell. This is ideal for web design in 2021 and in the future, where there is an increased focus on brand storytelling, Google, 2020. It also captures engagement and interest, as users don't need to do anything but scroll to interact with the story. Parallax scrolling, on the other hand, will persist given how it adds depth and aesthetic value to a web page, Impact Plus, 2021. Besides, because mobile users now outnumber desktop users, dynamic scrolling captures the same experience as they would on a smartphone. Dynamic scrolling highlights. Mobile users are five times more likely to drop engagement if a website isn't mobile friendly, hosting tribunal, 2021. Single page websites with dynamic scrolling hold user attention in thrall because they only require singular action the act of scrolling. Single page websites also emulate the experience on mobile. 10 Interactivity Consumers are becoming more aware of the idea that they can personalize certain elements of an online business. And interactivity will use artificial intelligence to do that in 2021. Interactivity means tailoring the website's landing pages and user experience based on the individual. Like chatbots, interactivity employs machine learning and neural networks, 
explain that stuff, 2020, to learn your browser habits or activity while you're on that site. It then guesses what you may need from the website and presents them to you more obviously than those you don't. This means two users may be on the same site but see drastically different content because their activities are different. 2021 will see platforms like Azure Machine Learning, Adobe Sensei, and Cloud Machine Learning come to the limelight. These artificial intelligence software solutions will help businesses build and deploy AI to their websites for improved human interactivity. Most Popular Website Builder Software Wix is an award-winning, cloud-based website development platform that serves millions of users all over the globe. Big Commerce is an e-commerce solution that offers businesses with the tools and functionalities to set up and operate an online store. Shopify is a platform with a variety of features that enable you to build and operate online stores and sell products. Weebly is a website builder that lets users create websites, e-commerce stores, and launch marketing campaigns all from the same platform. Squarespace is an awesome platform for individuals and small businesses that want to venture into online selling. Interactivity Highlights Hyperpersonalization will lead to interactive web design. Interactivity means tailoring the website's content and features to those relevant to the current user. This may employ machine learning and other nine chatbots. Chatbots are becoming more commonplace. These are programmed to learn from human conversation and apply solutions based on the conversation. These bots give customers instant response, unlike traditional human support. Even e-commerce businesses can benefit from chatbots because queries can be filtered and organized to actionable items for human oversight. During the latter half of this year and in the coming years, we will see more chatbots replace customer support, especially in social media. Technical support, where highly complex problems require human intervention at present, is not far behind. We're on a trend where we'll see chatbots handling 85% of human interaction with businesses by 2021, small biz genius, 2021. Bots now operate on a neural network, where the bot is not a single instance that interacts with the human user. Instead, it's part of a singular entity that learns simultaneously from all human input, on top of the massive information it's supplied within the beginning. Chatbots Highlights Companies are turning to chatbots to reduce overhead and filter actionable items. Chatbot programming is taking advantage of advances in neural networks and machine learning. Chatbots can save companies 30% in operational costs. Small Biz Genius, 2020. 85% of customer interaction with businesses will be handled by chatbots. 8. Accessibility. Accessibility isn't just to accommodate people with disabilities. In 2021, this trend will also feature web design that can be searched using voice, VR, or other non-keyword-based input. And just in time. According to eMarketer, there will be a projected 132 million U.S. voice assistant users in 2021, Statista, 2020, penetrating 39.4% of the U.S. population, eMarketer, 2020. Moreover, the adoption of smart speakers is also on the rise with a projected 23.5 million units sold in the U.S. in 2021, eMarketer, 2020, and an ownership rate of 34.7% in the U.S., Voicebot.io, 2020. Speech recognition algorithms are also catching up. For example, Google's voice recognition already scores 95% accuracy, DBS Interactive, 2021, which is already on PAR with human listeners. What this means is that this year and in the future, web designers should make websites that can be searched, indexed, and experienced without the use of traditional means. With the rise of VR and augmented reality, 
interaction with websites shouldn't just be limited to typing. The whole UX should also involve other senses. Accessibility Highlights People are increasingly using natural language and other non-keyword-based means to search the Internet. There will be 132 million U.S. voice assistant users in 2021. There will be 23.5 million smart speaker units sold in the U.S. in 2021. Speech recognition accuracy has gotten to 95%, at PAR or even better than human listeners. 7. Responsive and Adaptive Design Responsive websites aren't just a trend anymore. Since 2015, mobile searches accounted for 52% of all Google searches worldwide, Google, 2015. And 2021 saw this trend drastically accelerate with the current rate at 93.22%, Statista, 2021. 6. Asymmetric Layouts A web page is normally laid out in invisible grids, which allow elements of a page to be organized. Not so in the coming years. We will see seemingly chaotic or disorderly elements on a web page coming to a website near you. This doesn't mean, however, that the user should fend for themselves navigating through the mess. Instead, the new layout will eschew the traditional grid base and make the elements in the page float on their own. Rules for user-friendly navigation, Quick Sprout, 2020, still apply, however. This trend will likely incorporate other movements. These include the use of unconventional typography, organic shapes, and custom illustrations, and graphics. Asymmetric Layouts Highlights The regular grid in web design is going to be broken as web designers experiment with layouts. Broken grids and asymmetric layouts will be more prevalent. The use of custom illustrations and graphics and extreme typography will feature prominently in new or revamped websites. Intuitive user navigation, including hidden navigation and double panels, will be more relevant than ever. 5. Color Theory Redux Minimalism doesn't always translate to a website that's devoid of color. Instead, 2021 and beyond will embrace the use of bold colors and, specifically, gradients. The use of color, hosting tribunal, 2020, naturally links with the use of emotional design. This principle uses elements on a page, primarily color, to evoke certain feelings that you want your customers to have. For example, a charity page may use subtle colors to stir feelings of pity and sadness. Similarly, an e-commerce website may opt for vibrant shades that call for action. For smart video SEO pundits often say that auto-playing videos when a website loads is detrimental to your dwell time, but 2020 might have changed that. Dwell time the metric that measures how long a user spends on your website based on a search is one of the important factors in any website. You usually improve dwell time by making the site load faster, putting relevant information at the user's fingertips, and making navigation pain-free. Smart video, on the other hand, leverages video marketing principles to pique the user's interest. Video marketing statistics are in agreement. Visitors spend 88% more time on websites with videos, home business, 2020, especially catchy ones. Like micro animations, however, length is one of the biggest constraints here. Videos should be no longer than 2 minutes, with the highest engagement in the first 30 seconds of the clip, Vidyard, 2019. Smart Video Highlights Video is making a comeback in web design for 2021 and beyond. Smart ways to use video include auto-playing when a guest does an action or visits a part of a website. Websites with videos enjoy 88% more engagement than similar websites with none. 64% of consumers are more likely to purchase a product or service after watching a promotional video, home business, 
2020. 2. Premium white space. Corollary to the first trend, white space allows the readers of your website to rest their eyes as they peruse the content. Strategic use of white space on your website serves as a breather, which is useful in single page, dynamically scrolling layouts. It also improves readability, which is highly useful when you need to impart information to an audience quickly. Breaking up a text-heavy page with a profusion of spaces keeps the reader from being tired out by long strings of letters. White space comes in two sizes, macro and micro, and can be used either actively or passively. Macro white space refers to the space between graphics and copies on a website, while micro is the space between text lines, letter spacing, and other small elements. Meanwhile, Active white space is the intentional use of white space to lead readers to a conversion, or to a CTA. Passive, on the other hand, is the white space that happens naturally, not by design. White space isn't exactly white, it can be any shade, as long as it's empty. Empty in this sense means it has no contextual meaning, which is why it can also be called negative space. Wix a website builder, has a website that uses white space to great effect. Premium white space highlights. White space is a space with no contextual or semantic meaning. It's important to organize or highlight certain elements of a page, such as a call to action. White space comes in two sizes, micro and macro. It can be used in two ways, actively and passively. One flat is in. Minimalism isn't new per se as far as web design goes, but it's come to the mainstream public's consciousness with the rise of Apple's design ethos. Minimalism or flat design is as much an aesthetic choice as a practical one, too. Websites with flat designs often load faster than other sites with more complex shapes and ornate designs, thanks to their simple geometries and monochromatic palette. Flat design isn't just about simple shapes as well. Strictly speaking, flat design is a concept that uses simple silhouettes and sparse elements, but it also employs clever tricks. For example, flat websites often use hidden navigation bars and minimal buttons. Material design, Toptal, 2020, popularized by Google, will also have increased adoption because it's at home with minimalist websites. In 2021, designers will take these concepts to the next level. Gone will be the days when minimal means black and white. Designers will move toward more experimental layouts like overlapping elements, 3D or lifelike components, and organic or natural shapes. Flat is in highlights. Minimalism or flat design is still going strong through 2021. It's both a practical and aesthetic choice. Material design is going to be a big part of minimalism. Organic shapes, 3D or lifelike elements, and overlapping components will become commonplace.